Hey guys, welcome to SummerSlam. Welcome to Job Squad Wrestling. And what we have for you guys right here is a rematch right here, right now. And it will all be taking place inside of a steel cage. First up, we have the Slashers. Jason Voorhees, Michael Myers. They have been waiting since the third show for this rematch. In the first ever Job Squad Wrestling Tag Team title match, those two right there, the Slashers, took on Rick Grimes and Daryl Dixon from The Walking Dead inside that steel cage. That was the only other steel cage match that we've had in Job Squad Wrestling. And here we are having our second ever one, and it's the same two teams going at it. But this time, no titles on the line, only uh, revenge and bragging rights, I guess you can say, and moving their way back up the ladder, hoping to get a shot at the tag team titles in the future. And there they are. Look at that. Look at the cage just hanging above the ring. There's going to be a lot of brutality here coming up soon. Guys, I am ready for this. I hope you're ready. Michael Myers is standing in the middle of the ring. He looks pretty calm. He looks ready. He looks ready. Almost a weird sadistic smile on his face with Jason. He's not playing around. Look at him. He is here. All business here for Jason Voorhees. And inside the steel cage, we're not going to have any outside interference from their third little member, Freddy Krueger. So we don't have to worry about that. It's only going to be two on two, four men inside that cage. Only one team is going to be walking out the winners. And here comes your former Job Squad Wrestling Tag Team titles. They won that first match with a perfectly executed, both Rick and Daryl climbed out of the ring at the exact same time, over the cage and out to the floor. That way they didn't leave anybody in a two on one type scenario. Perfect plan. And it worked out great for them. And they went on to uh, have a lot of success here. They're 5-2. They defended those titles several times. Probably, uh, I don't know. I mean, they won the award for season one tag team in the season. So I, th I think it worked out pretty well for them. But all that was in the past. All that matters is right here, right now. The cage is lowering. All four men ready to go. And there's the bell. Michael Myers kind of walking around. Oh, just slips around the back of Daryl. Grabs a belly to back and a snap mare. The Slashers quickly on the offense here, starting this match off. Now the Slashers hold a four and two record. They haven't, they haven't been unsuccessful, that's for sure. They've only, it seems like the only time they've choked, they lost the match against Rick and Daryl for the tag team titles. And then they lost at Hell in a Cell this year. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Michael's right at near the top. No. Daryl grabs and pulls him off. Pulls him off the cage. But no. They lost here in season two at Money in the Bank when they lost to the Power Rangers in the number one contender match. So both matches they lost were really high profile matches. Who knows? Maybe they cracked under pressure. That's what a lot of people have been saying in the back. But hold on. Bring them down all the way to the ground. Daryl Dixon laid out now. Gonna be a lot of a lot of guys trying to climb out and over the top rope here. There is pinfall and submission as well, but we'll we'll see if that comes into play. Rick now has Jason in the corner. Meanwhile, bam! Big slam there on a Daryl Dixon. And over on the top side of your screen, maybe a pump handle slam here. Pump handle slam from Jason on to Rick Grimes. And for some reason, Michael Myers is going to try to climb to the top. I don't know why. That was a terrible idea. Daryl just pulls him down. Now Daryl's going up to the top rope. You don't fly too often. A big elbow drop. Takedown. Now working on the leg. Maybe Jason thinks if he works on the leg of Rick Grimes, he can't climb. It'll, it'll at least prevent him from climbing to the top of the cage and outside. Now Daryl looks like he's in the driver's seat. Laying in a big drop kick. And now catching Jason from behind. A couple punches. Basically no selling those. Jason not. Oh, now he's down. A lot of strikes there from Daryl. And a big spine buster. Rick Grimes. See what he can do here. Turns his back. No, now. Oh, what a what a headbutt. That's ballsy. We know Rick Grimes. He can get vicious when he needs to. He just gives a big headbutt at Jason for he's. I don't think that's been done before. Reversal. Now Jason throws him into the corner. Oh, over on the other side, though, Michael Myers has Daryl up on the top rope. Oh, my God. Reverse suplex from the top. Let's we'll see what Jason just whips Rick Rimes into the opposite corner. 
slowly, slowly, methodically chasing after him there. Or walking towards him, I should say. That's going to be a scary sight. But now, going up to the top. Might be going for a sky-high suplex here. From the tippy top. I look like Michael Myers hit a leg drop. And then as uh, Rick Grimes came down with that suplex, he looks like he actually hit an inadvertent leg drop on a Daryl Dixon. Oh, face first in the steel cage. We have the first use of the steel cage as a weapon. And then another time, right back to back. Daryl did a little taunt, let out a yell. Kind of let Jason know he was going to go for the top. And now Jason... See if Michael Myers can hold. This is looking good. Jason's up near the top. Somebody's got to stop Jason. He's at the very top. Ladies and gentlemen, Jason is crawling down. Somebody's going to have to stop Michael Myers. It's going to be Rick Grimes. Pulls him down. Michael Myers has... Ex sorry. Uh, Jason Voorhees has escaped the cage. But by doing so, he's left Michael Myers in a two-on-one scenario. Backbreaker into a Russian leg sweep, but overlook at the top of your screen. Rick Grimes now using this opportunity. He's climbing out. That's going to leave Daryl Dixon and Michael Myers, the only two left in the cage. This is basically turned into a singles match now. The next person to either get pinfall submission or climb over the top and both feet touch the floor will be victorious. And their team will be the winners here in this huge rematch at SummerSlam. A lot on the line here. Now, Michael Myers is choking out Daryl Dixon here. Foot it right into the throat. Gonna grab his legs, little, almost like a power bomb, just slams him right on his back. Is that gonna be enough to incapacitate Daryl Dixon? He's trying to get up. Michael's near the top, but no, climbing up after him. Daryl's got him and brings him down. Both men go crashing down into the mat. Daryl's back up to his feet though. Is he gonna go? Now taunting. A little cocky. He could have used that time to start climbing. We don't usually see Daryl Dixon. Wait a minute, wait a minute. H2O, Halloween H2O. His signature maneuver. Why is Michael Myers not climbing out of the cage? That is the perfect opportunity. And now Daryl Dixon reverses a punch. Big drop kick. Man, both guys Really messing up big there. Daryl took time to taunt. And Jason couldn't wait. Daryl's going to climb right in front of Michael Myers. A huge mistake. Pulled down and back of his head just whipped against the mat. Daryl's going to have to get up here. Slowly getting up. Is it going to be in time though? He's crawling. He don't know where he is. Hold on. Michael Myers at the very top of the cage. He's climbing down. Daryl Dixon. He's not going to be able to stop him guys. That's, that's it, that's your match, ladies and gentlemen. There's the bell. The Slashers are victorious here inside a steel cage at SummerSlam. What a rematch. We thought Jason messed up when he first climbed out of the ring and left Michael Myers in a two-on-one scenario. And if you think about it, the Walking Dead, they should have took that time to do a little more two-on-one damage, a little action there onto Michael Myers, but... Instead, Rick Grimes climbed over the top. And then Michael Myers climb out. And guys, what a win for the Slashers. Guys, this means they are now 5-2 in, in Job Squad Wrestling. And the Walking Dead members, Rick and Daryl, fall to 5-3. We got a lot more matches to come. Stay tuned, guys.